Yo, what is up everybody? It is Fakeosty, and today I'll be showing you the three best builds you can make in Hoop Life in Hoops Life. Two wait, so one is a point guard, one is a shooting guard, and one is a small forward. So let's start with the point guard. Alright. You're gonna okay, so you can do whatever here. I just like doing this. And then oh, next. Oh wait, crap. Go back and then make it six three. So point guard six three. And then, so you're gonna want to do pure red, and then let's see. Uh, yeah. So wait, no pure red. So you can get 99, 99, 96. And then after that, I like to pick the fastest one. So it's just this. And then, so you are going to want to upgrade. Um, interior, perimeter, all the way up. The perimeter is amazing on this. It's just the shooting is a bit lackluster. I shouldn't just say a bit. It's really lackluster. But this build is mainly a defensive build. Um, it's it's a good defensive build except the block and the interior are just low. So after you've done block to interior all the way up, uh, let's do some. Uh, so do ball handle and pass accuracy all the way up and then you're gonna want to do mid range the mid range and three point is not good at all but mid range like it's surprising you can still make fadeaways like non-contested fadeaways from basically anywhere um inside the three point line which is insane and then you're gonna want to upgrade close shot driving dunk or driving layup and then driving dunk and the rest you can put into post moves and then after that you should have a true menace the true menace is mainly just a good like defensive build for a point guard but um yeah anyways next build is you're gonna want to just okay so next build you're gonna want to do shooting gun um six foot five and then you're going to want to do um, blue and red. Um, so like the, um, oh crap, blue and red. So the shooting is once again not that good, but you can still make fadeaways from anywhere inside the three point line. So then after this, you're going to want to do the fastest one. Well, it doesn't really matter what you pick. It's just I like doing that. And then, so, yeah, once again, the mid-range is just completely terrible. Um, and then, three-point shot is going to be terrible. You shouldn't you shouldn't attempt any three-points, but you should still just upgrade it. Um, pass accuracy all the way up. Ball handle all the way up. And post moves all the way up. Um, close shot, driving layup and driving dunk are all all the way up so look 93 93 driving dunk you know what? i'd say that's pretty good you can probably room run if you really want to and then you're not like it's not like your interior I mean, your interior is decently bad okay wait never mind. so get rid of post moves um put all of these all the way up okay and then after that you can just put the rest into post moves so, 88 close shot, 91 driving layup, 93 driving dunk. So, this build is, it's good for everything except for shooting. Like, 18 finishing badges, 10 playmaking badges, and 20 defensive badges. But, like, you can do, you can decently do ball handles. Um, but you're not, it's not like you're going to make any, like, three-point shots or, like, heavily contested twos unless you're bailed out but the defense um you'll see the next build the next build is insane defensively okay so yeah all of this is all the way up and then you should have made a heart crushing point and now on to one of my favorite builds in the game no one really uses this the other two are heavily used and but this I really like it because it's unique and I barely see anyone using it. So you're a small forward, six foot seven, and then you're gonna want to do pure red. So just look at the defensive stats. 
82 interior, 90 perimeter, 88 lateral quickness, 86 steel, 89 block. In my opinion, this is the best defensive build in the game. The driving dunk is 87, the mid range is 64, so you can still make some um, decent fadeaways. But um, you can just pick. Uh, you can just still pick the same one. This is what usually what I always pick. And then mid range, you're gonna want to put all the way up. So once again, 64. Um, it does freaking suck, but whatever. And then three point shot. It's not like you're gonna be attempting any threes. Close shot, driving layup, driving dunk are all up. And then um, <clears throat> let's see. So pass accuracy, ball handles, and post moves are all the way up. Um, you're not gonna like this build is not good for playmaking or shooting. I mean the pass accuracy is decent, but there's zero shooting badges. So these build almost all these build or all of these builds that I've showed you are not shooting builds, but if you want to see other shooting builds, I created two builds already on them but um yeah so interior defense interior defense it's really good even though it's oh, I shouldn't say only 82 but 82 it's really good like I played with this build a lot and um, when the block is all the way up too you're not gonna get rim run on as long as you like time your jumps right like as soon as you see them go into the animation I jump a lot of people don't do that, they just jump like late and that's why they get rim run done. And then steal, you can decently abuse with this. Like if you're getting abused rim running and you don't know how to stop it, then just steal it when you see an open steal and then you are going to be good. Lateral quickness. Lateral quickness is so important because sometimes with the small forward build, I'm like really slow. And then I just get beat a lot, like to the rim. And then, yeah, so that's really important. And then perimeter defense. Take some out of post moves, put it in perimeter. And then put the rest into post moves. But the perimeter defense is actually insane. If you don't know how to play naturally good defense, this build is perfect. Or if you already do, then this build will help it even more. But I think this build is the best defensive build in the game. Like, I was literally 9 feet away from the dude and still contested it. But after that, you can just click next. And then you should have made a perimeter defensive expert. But anyways, once again, if you want to see other shooting builds, the link is in the description. But, um, yeah. This is my three broken builds in Hoops Life. And yeah, I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Peace out.